Mastering the Art, Formal and Informal Essays in English. Hello, dear learners. Welcome to another exciting lesson in English language learning. Today, we're focusing on an incredibly important topic, formal and informal writing styles. Specifically, we'll dive into the world of essays and discover how we can write effectively using both formal and informal styles. Whether you're writing an academic paper or a casual blog post, understanding these styles will greatly enhance your writing skills. Let's dive in. Before we delve into essays, let's quickly recap what formal and informal writing styles are. Formal writing is generally used in academic and professional contexts. It's structured, follows rules of grammar strictly, avoids slang and colloquial language, and is usually more detailed and technical. It's the style you would use in essays, reports, and research papers. On the other hand, informal writing is more casual and relaxed. It is often used in personal communication, creative writing, and on social media platforms. This style allows for more personal expressions, contractions, slang, and colloquial language. Writing formal essays can seem daunting, but don't worry, we're here to help. When writing a formal essay, remember these key points. 1. Formal language. Use proper grammar and avoid colloquialisms or slang. Contractions should also be avoided. 2. Structure. Formal essays should have a clear introduction, body, and conclusion. Each paragraph in the body should explore one main idea. 3. Argument and evidence. Each point you make should be supported by evidence. This could be facts, statistics, or quotes from reputable sources. 4. Impersonal tone. Try to keep your writing objective and avoid personal pronouns where possible. Informal essays, while more relaxed, still require a level of skill. When writing an informal essay, keep in mind. 1. Informal language. You can use contractions, colloquialisms, and even slang if it fits the context. Personal pronouns are encouraged. 2. Flexible structure. While a basic structure of introduction, body, and conclusion is recommended, you have more flexibility in an informal essay. You can play with the format to make your writing more engaging. 3. Personal tone. Informal essays allow for a personal and emotional tone. Feel free to express your feelings and opinions. 4. Engaging and conversational. Aim to engage your reader and make your writing feel more like a conversation. Understanding when to use formal and informal writing styles is key. In academia, professional settings, or when addressing someone of authority, formal writing is often expected. For personal communications, blog posts, or creative writing, informal writing is more appropriate. Remember, no style is inherently better than the other. It depends on the situation and purpose of your communication. Well, that's a wrap on formal and informal essays. We hope this video helped you understand the differences between these two writing styles and how to effectively use them in your essays. Remember, mastering these styles takes time and practice, so don't be discouraged if you don't get it right the first time. Keep writing, keep improving, and you'll see progress in no time. Happy writing!